Hey guys, Cold Phazard here, and welcome back to more Super Meat Boy! And in this bonus episode, I'm fucking pissed off, so let's begin. Make the fetus! Make that abomination. Aha, uh -huh, you're ugly. Forever alone! I like that. Anyways, yes, this is Super Meat World. I didn't even mention it because I'm kind of mad. I'll tell you guys in a minute. In a minute, but um, so what Super Meat World is is it's um, it's a thing where people create levels, world, not worlds, but yeah, they create levels and chapters, and some of these are really hard. Like the kids Xmas one, I didn't even finish that because it was way too difficult. And you can see on the upper right corner of these little things here that you can tell which character they use and it's usually the majority is Super Meat Boy so but um, the one I'm going to do for this bonus episode is Super Meat Land 2 and this one is really difficult too but I managed to get through it and you can see here you're using the grayish kind of Super Meat Boy I think the 4-bit or whatever but yeah here we go it takes a little while to load it up do 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 I'm missing a tooth, I am Snaggletooth. I don't know. My mom used to call my brother a Snaggletooth all the time. She's like, you Snaggletooth. But anyways, yes, um, the title is Super Meat Land 2. I've never played Super Meat Land 1. And so, we shall start at I won six golden coins. So, um, yeah, the reason why I'm pissed off is because, uh, damn it. I, this is my fourth time recording this, and what I might have to actually do is post-commentate this. I'm not sure if I'm going to or not. Damn it, can you get the case? Because what's happening is, every time when I play Super Meat World and play anybody's uh, game, or anybody's character, well, anybody's level they created, custom levels, um, like, it shuts down my game. Like, it's just random times it does it. And oh, I can't believe I did that the first time. But yeah, and it's really annoying because, yeah, it, it's, it's happened four times already. I'm just like, come on. So yeah, I, I might have what I might have to do is, uh, uh, every time when I beat a level, I'm gonna have to pause it. I'm gonna have to stop the recording and then restart the recording. So I don't really want to do that because I like doing live commentary, and it's it's only these custom levels because I obviously didn't have a problem with them in the actual Super Meat Boy game. So. All of a sudden, I come here and it's like crashing up and shit. Damn it! Stop hitting the big blade! God, there's so many blades in this one, but it's fun. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Fuck! <gasps> Do not get the mad, meet the boy. Anger will not get you anywhere. Other than a freaking busted brain blood vessel. I don't even know what I'm saying. Ugh, that must be so scary, because, you know, people die that way from, like, uh, what do you call it, an erupted blood vessel in the brain? That's so scary, because they just, they bleed out from the inside, and, uh, I don't know. Like, my dad knew somebody whose, like, daughter died from that. Mm, sad. But it's just scary, because, like, I mean, you don't know what goes on in your brain, you know? It's, everything happens just automatically, so... I mean, yeah, that's scary. Because it feels like it could just happen to anybody. I feel like ones with, like, a bad temper might get him. Because, I don't know, yeah. I was watching A Thousand Ways to Die. I remember a long time ago, some guy, he died, like, hanging upside down. And it was because all the blood was rushing to his head. And that's oh, obviously not good. So I think what happened was, like, the blood vessel started... Like, there was too much blood in the blood vessels, and so they started popping, and then, like, that's how he died. Like, he got unconscious, and then... <gasps> okay, yeah, and he died. But yeah, that's scary. So, let's get this key. And I'm doing so well, because, yeah, like I said, this is, like, my fourth time recording this crap. <gasps> okay, there we go. So, come on. Ah! Why did I jump into that? Like, come on, really? So, oh my gosh, dude. Um, you know what they put on Netflix? They put freaking Goosebumps on there. Oh my gosh, that's like nostalgia up the ass. Like, I remember watching that when I was in kindergarten. That's how old that is. It was like, it's like 1997. 
And I was like, I went into kindergarten, I think like in 1998 or some shit like that. Like, I'm only 19. Oh yeah, my birthday's gonna be soon. Yee! Eight more days, yo! I'm gonna be 20, and then I'll be 21, and I'll be able to go to fucking clubs and make out with all the hot women. I'm just kidding. But, yeah, it's gonna be nice being able to be, like, fucking going somewhere once. Because, like, I mean, they say you're an adult at 18. It's like, no, you're not. You can, you're seriously, like, you can't even do anything other than, like, buy fucking packs of cigarettes or rent, buy porno or whatever. But, yeah, like, I mean, if you want to go into clubs and have some serious fun, you got to be 21 to, like, really do anything. So, yeah, that sucks. But, yeah, um, I can't wait, I guess. Oh! There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ugh, I hate this one. Well, it's not so bad. It's just the stupid fans. Here we go. Like, the trick is, like, you gotta keep going, even though it looks like you're about to hit the fans. And then, like, I gotta go backwards. No! Don't! Oh! Fuck. So, yeah, like, I mean, like, you gotta keep going, but it looks like you're gonna hit the fan, but you're really not, so. And then, the harder part is when you're flying back. There we go. Oh, God. Okay, here we go. This one! Oh! Yeah. Please, please, God, please don't let this reset on me. It better not. I'm gonna be so pissed. Damn it! What was I saying before? Oh, yeah. 21 to be doing anything. Alright. So, yeah. I don't know. It just sucks. My friend's 22 and she can, like, go to clubs and stuff. And I'm like, aww. Because I'm always, like, stuck in the house. Not doing shit. Ugh! <gasps> I'm starting to get my textbooks in for, uh, for college, and that's a pain in the ass, kind of, but... I ain't getting that shit from my school, that's for damn sure. God, I hate textbooks. They charge you always an arm and a fucking leg for this shit, and sometimes a penis, but, you know... That's... I don't know, my dad's like, that's life, and I'm like, dude, there's cheaper shit. I, like, looked a whole bunch on the internet, and, like, I actually came across a nice site called, like, textbookrentals.com, so... What the hell was that? So yeah, I mean, like, if you're a student going to college and stuff, you need textbooks, I'd check out textbooks, textbookrentals.com. It's a pretty good site. It saved, like, almost $100 getting my books over there. Oh! Okay, here we go. This one isn't so bad. Just gotta go with it. Ah! Fuck. Uh, but yeah, um, I rented from this site I never even rented from. It was called, like, Skyo. And I had to get my, uh my big ass physiology book there my anatomy book but like that's a $200 book and rental was like $120 on Amazon why did I do that but yeah what I'm trying to say is I rented it there I like saved a little bit because the textbookrental.com site also gives you like coupons I'm not trying to advertise or anything like that I, I swear but um yeah it only costed like 70 like 70 some out dollars like 78 bucks and that was like a really really good deal and I was like oh my god there we go so yeah, and it, like it shipped and it came in in one day. I was like, what the hell? And it was like, it was in the same city. And I was like, oh, no wonder. I was like, what the fuck? Fuck! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hey, turn on the ignition. Okay, okay. What I'm gonna do is do this. Oh yeah, man, that's how I will. Okay, this one isn't too bad. Wait, hang on. Well, I mean, I practice these levels. Of course, I'm going to be know what I'm doing. I wasn't even thinking about doing this blind, but I'm really happy I didn't because... It just took me, like... Th doing all of these levels took me, like, two days to do. I'm, just, I'm not kidding, because these levels, man, when I first played them, I was like, what the hell, man? Fuck. Ah, oh, man, I didn't even get to watch the new True Blood. I didn't even go watch that, man. It's a pretty good show. At first, I was thinking like it wasn't gonna, it wasn't a good show. Why did I run into that? But you know, my friend was like, "Oh, it's really good." And then like it had that whole southern thing going on. I was like, oh, "I don't know." But um, and then you know, I was kind of like not so sure about it anyways because the whole vampire thing. Like you know how Twilight ruined that shit. Fuck. But yeah, I decided to watch, and I was like, "Oh wow, this is like really good." Hunt. Fuck. So yeah, there's that. I've also been watching Game of Thrones. That's pretty good. It's so confusing. Like sometimes I need it. 
Sometimes I need to, like, raise my volume to, like, hear anything, what the hell they're saying. I, I still get confused by the names. Dude, come on, get the through the, the fuck into the blade! I almost hit that one, jeez. Finally! Jeez, you piece of shit. Ugh, it's great, it's this one. Ah! <sighs> Oh, here's a good story for you guys. So, I finally sold my laptop I was trying to sell for a while now. Um, the reason why I was selling it is just because it was kind of big and I needed something thinner and smaller for um, for class and stuff like that. So, um, I tried to sell it on Craigslist and I said cash only and these retards still can't... Man, I don't even know what I'm saying. These guys still can't read and say, oh, you know, well, you traded for my iPod or you traded for my PS3 Slim. And I'm like, no, I said cash only, you stupid ass. But yeah, anyways, um, I finally just tried to sell it on eBay, even though I didn't really want to, because I know eBay hits you up on fees and shit when you sell stuff. And I wanted to keep all the money for me. I think PayPal, 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 sells you, uh, they take fees away from you too, PayPal. So yeah, oh, this level. Mm! So, yeah, um, I put it on for sale, and the next day, someone bought it, and I was like, oh, sweet, like, someone bought it. And it turns out it was, like, I don't know, it was some lady in Florida, and I was like, okay, no problem. And she was like, oh, can you send it to my son in Nigeria? I'll be willing to pay more than, um, free, sh you know, I'll be willing to pay for the shipping. And I was like, ugh. I was like, shut up, you fucking scammer. Like, I knew it was a scammer because, I mean, she was, like, offering to pay for the shipping and everything. And I was like, what the hell? I mean, come on, I put free shipping on it, too. It's like, dude. Oh, jeez, I'm gonna have a real hard time with this one. This one took me a really long time to do. I might have to cut this shit. If I could just, like, you know, make it over there. Ah! Oh, here we go. See, the thing is, is, like, you gotta... Ugh, not without hitting that one. You gotta go over there on the other side, like that, but then you gotta go under it, because you gotta get back the same way. <clears throat> okay, here we go. I don't know if I'm gonna make this. No, of course not. But yeah, that's what you gotta do, because that thing's open over there. I'm just gonna cut this up ahead, because I can't do this. This is gonna take me a while to do, so... Um, I guess see ya. Oh, wow, when I make it. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna make this. Yeah. Oh, okay. <sighs> you can do it. Oh, yes, thank you, finally. Jeez, like, 20 deaths later. Oh, man, I hate this one. <sighs> Be prepared, guys. I might have to do some real cutting in this shit. Ah! Oh, this one's such a pain in the ass, because, like, you gotta go down here. Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh, stop hitting the one that's like all moving and stuff, and that one too. Okay, so the problem here, um, I always hit that middle one for God's sakes, man. Ah, oh, fuck. Man, I can really lose my temper in this one. So with that, yeah. So you gotta like go out and out, and it's like fucking pain in the ass. If I can do this in like ten tries, I'll be happy and like. Okay, here we go. I feel like stopping the recording now because I'm afraid all my data is gonna get fucked. I should stop here and then re keep re recording or something because I don't want to lose my data on this because I. Okay, guys, I I'm back. So I thank God that I stopped the recording because it the program froze out again. So I gotta redo these levels. So I'm. And in a way, I'm kind of pissed, but in a way, I'm not because, like, I actually was smart enough to do that. Duh, why did I do that? But anyways, yeah, I was talking about the scamming lady on eBay. So, yeah, I knew she was a scammer because she was willing to pay more for the shipping. And, I mean, she was like, can you send it to my son in Nigeria? And, like, oftentimes, like, Nigeria is, like, the big-ass scam place. Like, a lawless country. But, yeah. Okay, let me see if I can do this. I need to concentrate right now. Yeah! Oh, I can't believe I just did that. Oh my god, like, I didn't, like, I thought about going through the, 
blades, but then, like, I was like, hell no! So, yeah, with the scamming lady, you know, she offered more shipping, and, um, she was, like, sending it to, Ni like, send it to my son in Nigeria. He's in the Peace Corp, and, like, oftentimes scammers will try to, like, be, like, all nice to you, and she was, she said she was, like, a Jehovah Witness and some something like that, and... I wasn't buying it at all. I mean, it could have been real. And, like, I looked at her account, and I just thought it was just too fishy. And, like, it was a big red flag. Like, the day she bought my laptop was the day she created her account. So, I mean... And I even told my dad about it. And he's like, yeah, that's a scam. I didn't, just don't say anything. I could say, I could have said something to her, but I didn't. I can't believe I made that, but... Yeah. And, yeah, you just saw there was a bandage there. It was weird. But, anyways, yeah, so I'd ignored it, and she didn't say anything the next day at all. So, I guess I'm assuming it was a scam. I can't, Oh, my God. I thought I hit the blades. I was like, geez, I might have to stop this recording and re-record because I don't want it to erase this. So, I was going to say after this one, but who knows? This one might freeze up my game, so I just hope to God not. But the good news is, is that we're almost done with this. And, you know, could end the blades. Thank you. Oh, God. Can you, like, stop? Stop it. This one's annoying because you gotta go back and forth. My thumb is killing me. Because all this back and forth bullshit jumping around these fucking blades. Blade vagina, blade vagina. Okay, here we go. Please, please, please. Thank you! Oh my god, I died like so many times and I just like want to die. Yeah. Nope, but I did not die. I'm almost done. Like, I seriously am almost done. Like, I think this is the third last one, so. Oh god. What was I talking about? Oh yeah, I was talking about Zoids. That was. I like that anime. I didn't. I don't think I saw all of them, but. My brother bought the little figurines, like the make. Build them yourself sculptured ones. And yeah, that one was kind of hard to put together but like yeah he got the white one so that one was pretty baity I always like wanted to buy one of those things where you buy the little uh, stuff and you build it yourself what the hell oh, okay I got the key o open up okay here we go all right jump in here get that one key yeah 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 and then get this one and then go out the edge right here Whew. last time I almost made it but I got caught in the gap up there such shit Oh my god, I made it. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, this is the last level, guys. So, I mean, if you were to try to regular jump, it wouldn't work. So, it's like, how the hell do you get up there? So, you gotta go like that. And then, you gotta, like, go on the outer edge area. So, it's really not that bad. This is, like, the easiest level to me. Shit. Oh, I missed it. I'm not dying. Yeah. So, uh... My thumbs are hurting so bad from this. I'm gonna fucking kill myself. Okay, come on. No, you did it wrong. Jeez, I did this in like two tries! Stop getting on top of it! <sighs> Bitch. There we go, okay. There we go! Get the key and. Oh, yes! I did it! Skyhook, I like that name for that level. <laughs> so, yeah, guys, that was it! Super Meat Land 2, I finally did it. A lot of editing out, of course. Oh, and I wanted to give out to, like, a, to give out a shout out to the person who made it, which is, I guess, underscore L underscore? Like, yeah, I, I didn't mention him, so sorry, but yeah, I just want to mention him for creating the level, and I don't know, if you're watching, then I enjoyed it, even though it broke my thumb a little bit. <laughs> So, yeah, that's it, guys. I am, I guess, done with Super Meat Boy. Maybe in the future someday I'll go back to this LP and maybe play a random-ass level again from created by somebody else. So, yeah. Um, thank you all for watching for now. Take care. Like, comment, subscribe, whatever. Do what you want to do. Have sex with it. <laughs> but, yeah, anyways, see you guys later. And, yeah, bye-bye.